How did he persuade you to go there? And no, he rang me up. He said, you've just been released. I've just been released by Villa. You know, I never talked to him before. And he said, uh, I'd be interested in bringing you down and we'll meet for a couple of years, sir. And I just said, where are you, Harry? And he went, I'm manager at Portsmouth now. And I said, well, what are they like? And he went, they're fucking shit, son. <laughs> That's exactly how he went. He went, he went, I've got rid of every one of them. He said, I want you to come down, be the captain for a couple of years. We'll give it a right effing go. And I said, Harry, I have to stop you there, mate. I said, I'm living up in the Midlands now. I said, I'm not going to move down for two years. I'm definitely not travelling down every day at my age. I had that at Middlesbrough. He said, I tell you what, son, don't work Mondays, don't work Wednesdays, don't work Fridays, but you fucking make sure you turn it on a Saturday. And I went, I'll be down in the morning, Harry. And I, I, I loved it, honestly. I could not talk highly enough of the club, the players, the fans. Give me the best year in my footballing career, if I'm being honest, at Portsmouth.